What's up? Welcome back to another video. I'm mad excited for today's video. So I don't know if y'all have heard Kendrick Lamar's new album, Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers. If you have, let me know what you think about the project and which song is your favorite off of there. Personally, I like the song Savior. It's probably one of my favorites. So there is this track called Die Hard on there with Blast. And Blast has been one of my favorite artists. The production and the instrumentation on the whole project, really. But this song in specific is really fire to me. So I'm going to quickly make you guys a beat in the style of the track die hard with blast you know what i'm saying um you can leave you can leave the blast what is that oh shit what is that make sure you hit that like button hit that subscribe button without further ado let's hop straight in this bitch all right so we're gonna go ahead and start with some drums you know what i'm saying just get that bounce down and then we're gonna go ahead and move into the motherfucking melody you feel me? no Yeah, I like that bounce kind of better. I'm not gonna lie. I might just do it throughout the whole jump. Let's go ahead and put this on the playlist so it doesn't do that skippy shit when I uh, copy and paste shit over. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this new hi-hat MIDI and drum loop pack that I'm working on. You know what I'm saying? You guys love the other one that I did, so I'm dropping this one. It should be out by the time this video is out, so make sure you scroll down. Go get that shit 35% off using the code abelia 35 Let's see, hold on, let me hear what, let me hear what, it is. what? And let me take out what we got. Let me do this. Oh, no, we gotta repeat that first part. That part was too hard to not. There we go, every other one. Go ahead and mess with these velocities, turn them down. And what we're gonna do is kind of shift them just a little bit to give it some more groove. So they're all gonna be a little bit off time, but just slightly in their own way type shit. And then we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing for our uh, hi-hat MIDI that we brought in. So to set the foundation of the melody that I'm about to make, I wanna go ahead and use this new plugin called Chromatic by this company called Lander. And yes, the fuck it is sponsored by them. So I'm not gonna try to sell you guys this product. I'm just gonna show you guys me using it, me explaining what I'm thinking when I do it. And yeah, hopefully that'll be enough. I'm gonna go ahead and find just something for the basis of the melody and then I'm gonna add stuff myself. You know what I'm saying? This will just kind of speed up the process and that's what it's really there for. You know what I'm saying? It's a loop library. At the touch of a key, I have a fire ass melody oh you heard God. me you know what i'm saying oh. you know what i'm saying and that, at the touch of a key you know what i'm saying we're gonna go ahead and record that these buttons up here they're like the sharp notes so you can use them to do different shit i can play it normal but if i play c sharp right here it's gonna be do it's gonna be double speed so you can do a bunch of shit. Halftime. Reverse. Tape stop. You can do a bunch of shit. like a piano type shit. So I'm gonna go ahead and record. I don't know how to play piano very well, so I'm gonna get it one chord at a time. Don't judge me. 
All right, take number two. You know what I'm saying? So we got the first chord. some vocals. So that is about it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you go in the description below and get that new plugin for 30% off. I wanna thank Lander for sponsoring this video. Shout out to you guys. And make sure you also click on the link to go get my new hi-hat MIDI and drum loop pack that I just dropped. With those two things, your workflow is gonna be so much smoother. I'm trying to tell you it's gonna be And I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video. Peace.